The reading comes from Isaiah chapter 10, verses 5 to 7 and 13b to 16. And it's an indictment of the superpower of the time. When you were studying English in the old days, there was a poem that said, the Syrian came like a wolf on the fold. Its corsairs were streaming in purple and gold. It was the superpower. It was gobbling up country after country after country. That eventually gobbled up the northern kingdom of Israel and started to gobble up the kingdom of Judah in the south. And he got all the way to the temple in Jerusalem and they started to put up a siege around the walls of Jerusalem. But a plague broke out. Lots of soldiers died. And they took that as a sign from their God that maybe this wasn't the time to attack Jerusalem. Maybe they'd be better off if they went home. And so they did. And so Judah was saved. Isaiah tells the king that Assyria is like an axe or, an, or a rod in his hand. He can use Assyria to punish people, but he also will be there to defend Judah when the time comes. But Judah has to obey the covenant, do the right, take care of the poor ones, the Anuim, the little ones, the orphan, the sojourner, and the widow, and be ready to do God's bidding. And if they only do that, then they have nothing to worry about from the great superpower called Assyria. Amen.